I got a fresh new symbol. All right, so I uh, picked up three things. This is the Scarlett Solo USB audio interface, one channel uh, for XLR. And then I guess I can plug in anything else if I do other recording straight into my computer. Uh, the reason I got this is because this is my Zoom H6. I don't know why I shoved the little thingy on it. I use this to right now record the drums. However, I keep having to unplug all the mics, unplug this, and take it over to my desk over there. This audio interface is gonna sit right over there at my desk and allow me to do any podcasting, voiceover, webinars, anything that I do for work. That way I don't have to keep on plugging this. I also got uh, something really, really cool. It's called an XLR cable and it's not exciting. It's just an XLR microphone cable. But this little guy, uh, I'm really excited to try out. So I've got a Zildjian uh, Sweet Ride. Zildjian New Beat Hi Hat and uh, Sabian B8 16 inch Thin Crash. This is good. This is good. This is not good. Here, here's what it sounds like. All right, remember that sound because we're gonna try out uh, the new symbol. All right, so this baby, uh, so shiny too, look at that. The uh, Zildjian Special Release Crash. I don't know what's special about it, and it's a 16 and a half inch. Um, looks really nice. Here's why I got it. I didn't like the crash symbol that I had right there. I'm a big fan of Zildjian symbols and wanted all my symbols to be Zildjian. And so I wanted a new Zildjian symbol. Symbols are not cheap. This one was on sale for like a, uh, over $100 off, I think. Um, so I got a really, really wicked sweet deal and the price has already gone back up for it. And here is what the new symbol finally sounds like. So much better. So much better. Uh, let's go check out my other stuff. Scarlet Solo. XLR cable. Uh, XLR input back uh, USB. All right, so here we have it. You can see when I talk, it uh, lights up green so that I can be monitoring myself visually. And if I yell, it goes from yellow to red, which also tells me I'm coming in way too hot. Uh, this would be the volume knob. This knob, I'm sorry, this is direct monitor uh, on and off. And, uh, I don't have to do direct monitoring. So if I turn direct monitor off, um, I'm still recording. So the audio still comes through. I just can't hear it in my headphones. Um, I don't know why I'd do that, I think. Cool, there you have it. All right, so it looks like the microphone works. What I've essentially done is I no longer have to plug in and unplug a, an audio interface every time I want to use a mic here. I can just record any voiceovers, podcasts, marketing videos, webinars, anything that I need this mic for. I just literally have to plug it in. I don't need to worry about cords and that over there. My Zoom H6 can stay plugged in with all of my drum mics. So today's a good day. Saving myself a ton of time and headache in workflow. And I got a fresh new cymbal. All right, you want to hear how the cymbal sounds? In real live drumming? Take it away.